What's up everybody, my name is Braskus and welcome back to the Magic Circle. That's about all I got. I'm excited to see where this goes. We gotta find more things to fill in, more creatures to steal the pieces off of, and I already see another crack we can go and absorb stuff out of. Although we're already at full anyway, but there's a whole bunch of stuff to fill in over this way. It looks like some new enemies. I'm excited. Alright, let's start by filling this stuff in. I wanna see where this goes. Oh, it filled it all in. Okay, that works. Oh, hey, these are structures from the lower world. All right. Jugodillo. I am Jugodillo, moved by ground. Nothing, 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 nothing true. All right, take all behaviors. And then exit. So they're basically totally fine. Nothing dangerous about them whatsoever. I like it. Okay, um, well. Got some places to explore, I guess. Let's see another creature over here. Let's see if we can grab him while we're at it. A hiver. Locked by groupthink. I mimic hiver queen, move by ground. Jesus, okay, well, forget that then. We'll let my buddies over there take care of it. All right, now, this area over here, there's a bunker down here. I wanna see where this goes. See if there's anything important down here at all. Well, there's something back there, but I've got no idea how to get to it, oh, so. Uh, I told you this sci-fi stuff is completely irrelevant to the demo. It wasn't me, sir, truly. Just some kind of glitch with great dramatic timing. I see. Hm. Wow. How old is this stuff? My God, it's years. I'll be 61 in the fall, Coda. No family. For better or worse, this is what they'll remember me by. Uh, yes, exactly. On that demo stage, you have to make yourself believe again. Long ago, I proposed a system that would generate unique offspring from player behavior. We could teach them like real children. The tech team said no. This is your baby. Tech will have to take the fake demo version as a challenge. You know? Yes, damn it. Saying this aloud, how can the demo be about anything else? That crowd has to see a child born into our world and love it as I do. To fear for its future as I do. What was it I said at the end of the original text adventure? By the time we understand our legacy, it is too late to change it. Oh god. Okay, I wasn't anticipating the war from the Hivers. Ow! Hey now! Whoa! Ow! Ah, uh, still sharp. We can do better. Okay, let's get up here and grab a whole bunch more of this. And avoid them, and let's head inside this way. If I can find that Hiver Queen, that's the one they're all locked by. Screw off. Oh god, they're everywhere. And all my little buddies are dead. All right, there's a log okay, down that way. Was off a few other things. Okay. Oh, there it is, it's inside. I mean, I guess I could have guessed that by all the little lines waving around over there. Okay. Well, let's see if we can go get to it then. I might die in the attempt, but I'm gonna try it. 
Go away, go away, go away, go away, go away! Nope, they got me. Oh, great. Very There's large creatures can't be trapped. Here. Even you. That life ends up in the cracks. You want to bring back a ghost? Gotta give it some life. And the bigger it is, the more it'll cost you. Just like the circle. Point is, boss, if it's worth doing, it's gonna hurt. All right, well, we'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, hey. I can edit you, though. I am your ally. What else can I give him? Special abilities. I mean, I can make him fireproof, but there's not really any reason to. Move by ground is fine. My enemies are... Make his enemy the Hiver Queen. Ah, I see something I want. What are these on your walls, Maze? Are these screen grabs of gamer profile icons? Oh, is this a cute little voice recorder? I've lost count. Not really. But that sounds cool. I call them my chorus of the damned. Do you ever think about going back to pro gaming? Nah. Your reflexes peak at 23, 24. Another thing I've lost? Chasing the ship date. But I tell you, after a day on this project, I do like to sit here, open an ice cold beer, and just hit play on all of them at once. In fact, that sounds really good right now. Get out and close the door. <laughs> Maze is kind of scary. Ooh. There's a rock. Oh, a rock doesn't really help me that much. I've already got the stuff from the rock, so I don't really need to take more. Ooh, ooh. Hi, hi. Kill it, please. Thank you. Pretty sharp. Can I edit it now? No, it's locked by this groupthink thing. It's good to be real. Okay, my howler buddy should take care of that. What's over here? Every world's got an in crowd and an odd man out. Like Starfather and his entourage, whispering in a tight little circle. And me standing at remove and shouting, You ain't so hot. From here I can see all your asses. And scheming to make it all fall apart. But if the oddball wins, hell, they become the new normal. No thanks. If there has to be a new boss, I choose you. Nope, I keep doing that. Uh, exit, and then pick up. Alright. Let's see if we can find a way through these caves that maybe makes it easier for us to, you know, get through this Hive Queen thing. Well, there's definitely stuff here I want. Okay, here we go. Here we Let's go. start with this. Well, read my script. Thoughts? It's a little safe. In Act Three, when Starfather returns from the dead, it feels cheap because nothing has changed. Respectfully, we've already solved this in fanfic. Oh, that's a porn thing, isn't it? And I. I... I don't go in for that kind of... Starfather should come back as a woman. For he hath known the shape of man and woman both. Your words. This is surreal. You people know my world better than I do. 
And if you run into a story problem, I can start a forum argument about it. They won't even know they're working for you. Don't stand up. <laughs> Tell me more about your dark art, my child. <laughs> All right, we got another creature stat upgrade. And one of these. So, Eric, I want the name of the level drudge who put a flamer behind magic bars here and thought it'd behave. Do you people ever actually watch QA play the game? Everyone who comes in here misses whatever BS scripted scene is supposed to be sold in this zoo escape area because by the time it starts, the flamer gets aggroed and the player is just a nuclear shadow on the wall halfway through a shrug. Anyway, I took out the fire burst attack. That solves the first half of your problem. After whatever space magic happens that makes the bars go away, don't expect this thing to do much. I suppose that's one sig solution. Flamer discovered. Oh, can I activate it now, though? Allies are now the hero. Thanks very much. My enemies are definitely the Hyper Queen. Special abilities, got nothing. He attacks with melee, move by ground. Well, you can let him move. But he has nothing to attack with, except melee, I guess. Okay, so now I've got a flamer that can at least do something for me, but we'll try and make him better a little later on. Ooh. Max life increased. Sweet. Okay. Really glad I came down here. Still curious to see where this is going to take me, though. Oh, right back inside. Okay. Oh, crap. He killed it. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, fill in my howler. Well, I filled in the howler, but it didn't really work. Okay, but maybe I can find the other howlers that all died. No, oh, he's right there. Okay. So I've got a howler with me. Now, if I can keep the other howlers alive, or at least just keep filling them when they die, maybe I can actually get through this. So we'll trap him and fill him. And the rat. And the other howler. And then drain that and they can all help me kill him. Because now I've got my own little, like, army back. And I can just keep filling the howler as it dies. Now I'm almost out of life, so why don't we go back and get a little bit more from the crack. And then we will, uh... Basically rinse and repeat my way into that hive thing, and then I can start unlocking their behaviors. Because now that I've seen where it lives, I've gained a taste for it. I want it. I mean, the rat's not really going to do anything. He's just going to sit there, but still. Glad I went through there. A whole bunch of cool stuff that way. Okay, now they've got to be starting to run low on these things. Okay, so the Howlers can't really kill him when he's trapped. And that's fine. Alright, we're good. There's another one. Go get him. Go get it. Well, crap. That didn't work at all. Well, okay. 
I guess I can edit them and make sure that their enemy is not the Hiver Queen anymore. But I really don't want to leave all of them there because they're useful to me. They will continue to keep me alive, so worth it to go get them back. Uh, let's see. Okay, I'm not sure who turn tuned to the Queen Encounter, but her melee range is way longer than the player's sword, and her attack rate does not leave openings for any approach. Even Maze can't get near her without getting insta-killed, as her damage was set ridiculously high. This is a progress blocker. Please fix immediately, and maybe test without cheats before checking in your changes, Jim. Added to inventory the Hiver Queen. What does that mean? Nope. Okay, so... Edit him. Look left to upgrade this creature, but be careful upgrades are permanent. Yeah, I know. It's this stuff over here. I'm just going to take all the behaviors off of him again. <clears throat> now, with you... Enemies are nothing. Okay, so... Enemies are nothing, and enemies are... We're going to take Hiver Queens off. Say nothing. And we'll fill them and take them with me, and we'll just leave, because it's not doing me any good to attack that thing. I don't think. Yeah, I mean, I can increase his life, maybe, his attacks speed, but I don't really think it's going to do me any good, so I'm not going to worry about it at the moment. Alright, we'll go fill up on life again, and then I guess I'll just head to the next area that's over that way and see what else I can do, because that Hiver Queen at the moment, no idea how I'd get around it. There's got to be some way of tweaking it, but until I can... I don't know, unlock an ability to get close to it or stun it or do something so I can edit it. There's nothing I can really do. So, okay. In the meantime, we'll go that way. Or do I want to go that way? I don't know. Um, let's actually go that way. I want to see more of this sci-fi world that came before. Let's see what there is to learn about that. Okay, well, we're good. Happy with what I have for the moment. Are those maybe actual flamers? Hey, anytime I can get more of these, the happier I'm going to be. Let's see what we got here. Coda, I'm alone in a conference room. I scheduled a meeting with myself in search of quiet. What is it? A Mr. Byron Rafe called? You're a loan officer? Yes. He says you've taken out some, quote, Faustian personal loans to make payroll. And unless this project hits big, which it will, you end up slightly homeless. So please stop offering me a salary. Coda, I find the right people, I lock them in a room. The only word for what emerges is a miracle. Or we kill each other. Either way, problem solved. <laughs> that is certainly one way to look at it. Okay, well, I'll take your word for it. Okay, um, I guess we'll go see what happens. Well, let's see what's over here first. Okay, so there's an elevator over there, what looks like some sort of a space shuttle there. Green blood's over that way, so I want to go this boss. way first. Maybe you see a problem and your solution don't seem clean enough. Like maybe the gods wanted you to do something else. Something perfect. Fuck that. 
Chasing perfect is what got them into this mess. If your way does the job, it's more right than they'll ever be. Crap, okay. Uh, I need to edit one of you so you have the lightning rod ability. Come on. Ugh. Hope you ain't expecting actual magic. Cause all this, just a cheap trick. And under that, a cheaper one. All the way down. The magic comes from outside the circle. Like you. Aw, don't I feel special. This map is big. And I didn't really anticipate this one little building to suddenly turn into this gigantic thing. So the original text adventure only briefly touched on the distant future at the end. Back then I just wrote whatever I wanted you to imagine. And were shocked when you paid me so well. So I may have surprised you to begin on a space station. And I recognize that compared to the original, this time, your hero was a little more anti. Anyway, for all his faults, I hope the pro found a way under your skin. And added to inventory the text version. Okay, so that's the third elevator I've found. This is airlock B. Obviously, we owe an immense debt to the Clarkian first contact stories. I mean, you've played it by now, but I can't help pitching. An object nicknamed the Magic Circle appears in space, in a universe danger close to heat death, okay? But the brave souls who volunteer to suit up and pass through the circle come back dead, but wearing this beatific grin. Classic. I mean... If you are in Tingly right now, you have no soul. Yeah, yeah. Mushroom wizard? Hero, I can shield you with my magic, but I'm locked in Nadir's prison. Oh, sorry, free me. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Well, I can certainly try and figure out how to do that. Okay, so I'm going to need a key to free the mushroom wizard. Got it. All right, now one of you I made fireproof. That's good to know. I may need to edit some of them so that I've only got the one. Um, okay. I'm gonna edit these guys so that they move by nothing. Yeah. Pulling off his legs will work as long as you don't go near him. I feel a little bad about this, but I don't I just don't want them following me. because I don't want to have to spend the life again and again and again to bring them back. So the only one I'm going to take with me is this guy here. Yeah. Because I can see the flamers that are around. Um, now I'm trying to remember how I send them to, ah, I know there was a way to do it, but I can't remember what it was now. Oh God. All right. Well, that's why I brought him with me because he's immune. All right. Take all behaviors. Fire burst acquired. I'm just going to take all the behaviors off of two of them, so I've got them in an inventory. And then these other two I'm going to edit and make me the... ally. And then 
fill them. And now I have friends. Though still no idea where the key is for this mushroom wizard dude. Oh, they can't move. Okay. Uh, Alright, that's fine. Hi, Mushroom Wizard. You're shielding me, and that's awesome. Um, Alright, so now I'm going to put them so that they can move again. And now we can go back here to these flamers and allow them to move by ground. I wonder if the flamers might be able to help me deal with the... Um... Let's, let's try and use the flamers on the Hyra Queen and see if that does the trick. I mean, theoretically, she could just attack them like she's attacked the dogs, but I guess there's only one way to find out, right? Oh, that's how I do it. I'm an idiot. I forgot. I need to switch tools in order to do that. Okay, you know what? Never mind. Well, that thing's creepy looking. Sentinel discovered. It flies, you can't trap it, so ghost it and edit it afterwards. Alright, go get him. I can't tell if that's working or not. Whoa! Yep, that worked. So he moves by float, attacks with repulsor, special abilities nothing, allies are me. Phil. Creatures that float cannot move on their own. Well, what good are you then? Oh, wait, does that mean I can... Can't even direct him by editing him. All right, well, what's over this way then? Oh God, more flamers, okay. Go get him. Oops. Well, I got too close. Not really a big deal. I can go back and get him all anyway. All right, I'm just gonna edit him and take all of his stuff because he's not really helping me over there. Take all behaviors. Let's fill some of these guys back up. And let's go see if we lost any of my allies over here. Go kill it, please. Okay, so apparently my own flamers can kill me, so that's worth mentioning. Alright, there was a crack up here somewhere, and then I can head over that way and not die. Um, where'd it go? Right there, okay. Maybe I'll just start stripping the flamers of everything and just taking them with me. Or instead of taking them with me. Take 
take all. Ah, uh, take all. Take all. I just don't want to res them by accident and then wind up getting killed, so. Now I've got a whole bunch of fireproof and flaming stuff forgotten. Key discovered, okay. Ooh. Okay, well that certainly didn't do that. Oh, what the? Okay. So I filled the key. What's this say? Two problems here. First, the key, it's only meant to become visible when the player uses the search skill. So for QA purposes, I added a temp erase button. Once proper RPG skills finally get implemented, testers can delete the key and retry searching at all skill levels. Second problem, the lava. Guys, it's easy. You place the arc for the lava, then you place an invisible box-shaped trigger around it. When players or creatures hit that box, it deals fire damage. But when your trigger box sticks out of the lava like this, it kills things inexplicably. The hero is supposed to watch a couple of hapless juggos plunge in and get burnt here, but thanks to you, they spawn dead. I'm making misplaced triggers like this visible in-game until fixed. Maybe a public shaming will get you guys to check your work. Okay, um... Yeah, he just dies the second he comes in, but... We'll make him fireproof first. Yeah, okay. Where's this go? Oh, this is the other side of the mushroom wizard, dude. You may be wondering when I'm gonna let out an evil laugh and stab you in the back, twirling my mustache with my off hand. Well, don't panic, boss. But in a way, that already happened. Bringing you here was it. Okay. Well, um. Honestly, I'm all out of time for this one, guys, so we will try and figure out what I'm supposed to do in the next one. I'm thinking what probably needs to happen is I need to find a way to cross this. Now, I've got the float ability and I've got the fireproof ability, but. Even though they're fireproof, they'll probably just fall down to the bottom. Huh. I don't know. We'll have to play with it and see what we can do. I, there might be a way for me to, like, use them as stepping stones or something to get over there. Or maybe I can send them over to pick it up and come back. But I'll need to figure that out. But I'm all out of time for this episode, so we'll have to do it in the next one. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. I'm definitely liking it, and the creativity is still flowing strong. It's a fascinating game. The ability to erase it and bring it back and I, this is just really cool i love this so if you're enjoying it as much as i am please make sure you hit the like button feel free to hit that com or uh, <laughs> feel free to hit the like button please leave a comment in the section below and as always i will see everyone in the next episode catch you guys later